Hey everyone, Craig and Jen here, giving our first review ever. We hope you like what you see at the Seneca Niagara Resort and Casino. Here you go. Check out the room. Oh, this one comes with a girl. <laughs> Nice king size bed. A little makeup area over here. Desk area. Zoom out a little bit. Entertainment center. Closet. Three drawers, rather well, pretty big, these drawers. Another closet with ironing board, iron. A refrigerator. And a safe. Small fridge, can hold a little bit of stuff. Desk area, seating area, two end tables, a phone, alarm clock, oh, the Bible. <laughs> and of course the view. I believe the falls are over there somewhere. That's where all the mist was coming up from. The lady at the front desk said there is no falls view from the American side, actually. The bathroom. The bathroom's pretty nice, actually. What's in here? Oh. Toilet, a little bit of privacy. Oh, wow, you can even make a phone call sitting on the toilet. And this shower is really nice. I like this. It's beautiful. It is. Look at that floor, the tile floor. So Jen, how many people do you think we could fit in this shower? <laughs> Stop. Usual <laughs> ten. I think it's just maybe two. That's about it. Two people. That's enough. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's see if I can... What did you just say? This hotel rocks. Yeah, she's really excited about the magnifying mirror <laughs> over there. So. That's it. Hope you like the room. So far, I do. It's great. Yeah. I love it so far. We just got here. Now let's check out the rest of the casino. When you enter through the main doors, you're going to come to the lobby area. And there's several different places off of this. A bunch of restaurants all over. There's a lounge. And there is the front desk, which you see here. I definitely recommend the Fancy Steakhouse. The food was delicious. You can also try your luck at the casino like we did. Jen wanted to try her luck at the slots. I don't recommend it. They always seem to take your money. That's what they did here to her. We then made our way over to the table games. It's something that I'm familiar with and I win more than I lose. And that's what we did tonight. We won a few hundred dollars, which helped pay for dinner. 
and the little bit of money that she lost playing the slots. We finished out the night having a few drinks at the lounge. Just water for me though. I'm not a big fan of alcoholic beverages, but Jen loves her martinis. The next morning I had breakfast by myself at the Three Sisters restaurant just off of the main lobby area. Jen's not really a big breakfast person. I had the buffet, which was absolutely delicious here. They have everything that you can imagine at a breakfast buffet. Eggs, bacon, sausage, uh, waffles, fruits, vegetables. Uh, here I am having some oatmeal. The coffee was delicious and a bunch of pastries. We also had dinner here one night. I had the New York strip steak and Jen had a salad. But I gotta be honest with you, the New York strip steak was not that good. It could have been better. I mean, every bite I took, it took about maybe 50 chews to be able to swallow it. It was pretty tough and pretty fat, and I ended up cutting a lot of the pieces off. If you're going to get a steak, I'd recommend going to the other steakhouse we ate at before, which is through the casino. I had the filet mignon at the steakhouse, and it was delicious. Here's a sunset view from our hotel room, looking out towards the direction of the falls. If you look closely, you can see the mist coming up from where the falls actually are. I'd say it's probably about a five minute drive. The Seneca Resort says that it's a six minute walk. There's also an indoor pool and hot tub that you can use all year round. We skipped this during our visit. We also made a cinematic and informative YouTube video on our trip to Niagara Falls. If you'd like to see this video, you can click on the link provided. In the making of the Niagara Falls video, we came across these type of crab apple, berry, nut type of uh, things that we found all over. I asked if anybody knew what they were called. I promised them a shout out in the next video. So Hatui Castillo said that they were ginkgo nuts. I did some research. It looks like he's correct. So here is a shout out for Hatui Castillo. If anybody's looking for another subscriber, um, I subscribe to his channel as well as he subscribes to mine. He's based out of uh, the New York City area and he gives a lot of walkthroughs of the different neighborhoods and streets of New York City. Now getting back to the Seneca Niagara Resort and Casino. If I were to ever come back to Niagara Falls, I wouldn't even look up researching any other hotel to stay at. I was very happy with this resort and I would definitely stay here again. Thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. It's free. Please be sure to check out our other YouTube video, The Cold Weather Experience in Niagara Falls. It's provided in the link below. Thank you. Have a great day.